With the BRAF and MAC inhibitor drugs, the side effect profile differs a bit by specific type of BRAF and MAC combination that you give. For example, if you give the combination of dibrafenib and trametinib, there can be a high rate of fevers and chills in patients, and patients need to be instructed to hold treatment with the dibrafenib and trametinib when they're experiencing fevers and chills, and know that the fevers and chills will resolve with some time. Vemurafenib and cobimetinib have more skin side effects, and it's important that patients are careful in the sun because they could have extra sensitivity to the sun and get really bad sunburns if they're not careful in that respect. And then encorafenib and binimetinib have other kinds of toxicities like achy joints can be a problem in some patients with those treatments. And so I'm mentioning these specifically with each BRAF and MAC inhibitor combination. Of course, any different types of side effects can happen with any of the three BRAF and MAC inhibitor combinations, but those are some of the side effects that are a little bit more common with one combination versus the other.